Welcome. This is Kathleen L. I am so honored that you have joined me today for this meditation. This meditation that I'll be guiding you through is called the Tree of Life Meditation, and it is taught by Deidre Haid and adopted by Jack Canfield. And it is it was one of the most connected meditations that I've had in a very, very long time. And I wanted to share it with you. So I hope that you enjoy this and that you find a comfortable space to sit in, uh, eliminate the distractions, meaning even if you have to go in a particular room and close the door so where it's only you there, you can do that and turn your phone off. Um, and just allow yourself to be. And just know that if there are distractions or noise in the background, you'll, it just will help you be go, become uh, more and more in tune with yourself and uh, assist you in going deeper in your experience through this meditation. I hope that you find this helpful um, and that you're enjoying it. And um, so we're gonna get started. So now that you have found a quiet, comfortable space, just go ahead and take a deep breath in, whatever way makes you feel comfortable. And on your exhale, just allow your eyelids to gently close. And as you gently allow your eyelids to close, just begin to become aware of your breathing. Just flowing in and out and just consciously focus on that. And as you allow your breath to become a little deeper and slower, paying attention to the sensations of the rise and fall of your chest and stomach as you slowly breathe in and out. And with each breath, you can feel your body begin to relax. Just becoming more and more comfortable upon the surface that you're sitting in. And as you're relaxing, starting with gently allowing the muscles in your face and your jaw to relax. Now becoming aware of your shoulders and simply allowing them to gently fall and relax. Just as you're focusing on your breath flowing in and out. And now you're feeling the muscles in your hips, in your legs, gently relaxing. Just allowing the chair at the surface you're sitting upon to support all of your weight. Become aware of a radiant sphere of pure white light as brilliant and as bright as the sun, floating and spinning 10 feet above your head. This pure white light is the pure essence of I am presence, the source of all creation. And imagine gently rising up into that sphere of translucent white light and then gathering this light and gently bringing it back down in a column of light where it begins filling and activate, activating the pure white light of truth as a spinning ball of radiant white light on the top of your head 
awakening and opening your crown chakra until the crown of your head opens like a beautiful flower, awakening into pure consciousness. And now this incredible white light that is gently pressing into the top of your head begins to pour into the left hemisphere of your brain. The pure white light of divine understanding, completely filling the left hemisphere of your brain where it begins to activate a shimmering and spinning ball of radiant white light of truth and understanding. And your left hemisphere is now vibrating with a pure electrical energy of brilliant and refined thought. And now this light pours across your head, across the bridge that connects your left and right hemispheres, activating this energy of pure knowledge in the center of your brain, and then pouring into and filling the right hemisphere, activating the wisdom as it begins to pulsate and spin, growing brighter and brighter, awakening divine wisdom and truth. And now you begin become aware that there are three spinning orbs of light. The one at the crown of your head, the one on your left side of your brain, the one on the right side of your brain. And as these three are spinning, you're filling them with pure light, light of the crown to heal, to activate and to regenerate. They start spinning together. Now this light of truth, wisdom and understanding pours down into your throat. The light from the crown now pouring through your throat, filling your throat, clearing your throat, knowing now that your words will become wise as they are filled with understanding, truth, and knowledge emanating from the crown of light. And now the light streams into your shoulders as it becomes a brilliant red color. And you see this red light pouring down your left arm into your hand, into your fingers. This is the light of receiving, awakening, strengthening your ability to receive. It is the light of restraint and the light of healthy boundaries. This is also the light of discernment, of knowing what is good for you to let in and what is not. It is having good judgment and healthy boundaries as well as rigor and discipline. And as this light fills your hand and fingers, your left shoulder and your left lung, and it pours down your arm into your elbow, down into your hands and fingers. Your left hand reaches out to receive what it needs to receive, but also sets now a boundary guiding you to know what with wisdom, where you need to say no in your life. And now take a moment and ask yourself, where do I need to open up 
in my life to more fully receiving what is being offered? And where do I need to demonstrate better discernment and set boundaries in my life? And now the light pours from your left side through your heart, knowing that all external noises only bring you deeper and deeper, awakening and healing your heart chakra, and pours into your right shoulder and right lung, and becomes the turquoise blue light of healing, benevolence, loving kindness, forgiveness, given and offering, service and devotion. And you can see this turquoise blue light becoming larger and larger and brighter and brighter as it spins and pours down through your arms into your hand as this energy of compassion, loving kindness, Service and giving pours out of your fingertips. And now just take a moment to ask yourself, where in my life do I need to express more compassion, more generosity, more forgiveness, and more loving kindness? And now you can see the light pouring down into the center of your body, filling all of your internal organs with a brilliant golden yellow light as it awakens your solar plexus. It awakens peace, beauty, harmony, and balance. The balance of giving and receiving the balance of wisdom and understanding. And this balance brings harmony and peace and tranquility. And as you're experiencing this light in your solar plexus, growing brighter and brighter, go ahead and ask yourself, where in my life do I need to create more balance, more harmony, more beauty, and more peace? And now, you pour this river of light down into your left hip, filling and igniting your left hip with a vibrant orange light. This light is of your life purpose, your divine soul's purpose. It is of the source of inspired ideas and new inspiration. As it falls into your left hip, it is also your nobility, your dignity, because your dignity is intrinsically tied to living your divine purpose. This divine vision for your life is here. So you now fill your left hip with this vibrant orange light. And part of accepting your divine purpose is the willingness to stand in your dignity and mobility and nobility, to not bow down subservience to another, to own your authority, and to stand up in your authority. And as you allow this light to pour down into your left leg, filling your left leg, and filling the bottom of your foot with its orange light, you can feel yourself taking a step forward, 
a strong step into your divine purpose and standing firmly in your inner knowing, standing in your truth, ready to manifest your unique divine life purpose. And just now take a moment to ask yourself, where in my life do I need to be taking a stronger stand, standing up for my truth, standing up in full alignment with my true purpose. Now this light pours across your lower abdomen into your right hip as the light becomes a brilliant emerald green in color, activating a spinning ball of emerald green light, the light of victory, of manifestation and abundance. It is the light that takes steps out into the world and manifests your dreams and your ideas your ideal relationships. And as you fill yourself with this brilliant emerald green light, it pours down your right leg, filling your right leg and filling your feet and with light. So that when you take a step forward with your right foot, you are manifesting, you are taking action fully supported and in alignment with your dreams. Now take a moment to ask yourself, what actions do I need to be taking in my life right now to manifest my dreams and fulfill my true purpose? And as you feel all of that light pouring down into the center of the earth, all the way down to the core of the earth, blending and combining, making it a brilliant white light. It's as if you have roots like a tree flowing out to the bottom of your feet, going all the way down into the earth. And as those roots wrap, wrap around this pure white light, a sphere of pure white light, a big ball of white light, right at the core of the earth, you feel those roots being filled with this brilliant white, pure light. The divine feminine white light is full of power, transformation and knowing a cleansing and a healing as that divine feminine light flows back up through those roots completely filling those roots so it radiates out those roots all the way up, all the way up into the bottom of your feet and feeling that just pure white light filling both of your feet, flowing up through your, your feet, your ankles, healing, absorbing, washing away all that no longer serves you anything that you're holding on to, any shame, any limiting beliefs, any stuck emotions, that pure white light as it flows up into your legs, up into your ankles and your calves, completely fills you and absorbs all of what no longer serves you. Pulling all the way up into your knees and your legs, your calves, 
your thighs, completely filling your thighs, filling your hips, your lower abdomen, front and back, just totally, completely filling you all the way up, flowing up through your spine as it pours out your spine into your organs, into every organ, every cell of your body, flowing all the way up into your heart, into your shoulders, down your arms, into your hands and fingers and out your fingertips. Pulling all the way up into your neck and your jaw. You feel that pure white light essence completely absorbing anything that no longer serves you. This magically turns everything into pure light. Pulling into your jaw. your cheeks, your nose, your cheekbones, your eyes, your forehead, out the back of your head, out your ears, and up through the top of your head, flowing all the way up to that divine masculine source of energy, the golden light, as that golden and white light just blend. So it's a sparkly white golden light. Going back through your head, back down your face and your brain, down into your, your neck, your shoulders, your arms. And it just lands in your center of your, your being right in your center and it flows out. So you, now your body's completely filled with this sparkling white light and it just radiates out further, further, further as if you're encompassed completely by a ball of light, the sparkling white light. And only love and light flows in and love and light flows out and any other energy bounces off the outer exterior of that ball of light into the universe and dissolves into love and light. Now bring your awareness back to the center of your being. And just know that that will be carried with you throughout the day, throughout the week, throughout the month, year, it is there for you as your awareness comes back to your arms and legs, fingers and toes. They start to move and your eyes spontaneously open when you're ready. Take a deep breath in and let the edges of your mouth curve up into a smile and welcome back. I'm so grateful that you're here with me. Thank you for joining me. Know that you can listen to this at any point in time, whenever you feel like it. I hope this is helpful. Don't forget to visit me at KathleenL.com or at the From Grief to Belief Stepping Stones, where you can be supported and have guidance and inspiration on a daily basis on an, in a private Facebook group. Have a wonderful day.